So guys, The Fiend has returned at WWE Fastlane 2021, and oh my goodness, his new look is absolutely terrifying. I cannot believe how good WWE did with this. I had a couple ideas in my head to what he could possibly look like when he did return, and I was not expecting this at all. It looks amazing. I do have pictures to show off here in the video for you guys, so do not go anywhere. We are going to get into checking those out right now. Let's check out picture number one. Look at this new mask, guys. I love it. They are playing off of his original mask, of course, but they did give this, you know, a burnt look. It looks like his mask is now melting. It, it looks really awesome. It's very creepy. It's very dark, very grungy looking, and I absolutely love it. Now, this next picture will give you a better look at his mask. Like, just look at that, guys. Oh my gosh, it's terrifying. The only thing I could critique here about this is I think they should have put more makeup around his one eye because you can see like, you know, just normal skin there. It doesn't look burnt at all or anything like that. So they should have put like makeup, you know, like gray or black like they did for the other eye. You know what I mean? And I love how his one eye now is completely white. It reminds me of Kane and that's okay. I absolutely love it. I like what they did with his hair too. They made it look kind of naughty looking and uh, I don't know, like it, it, you know, like it got burnt or something like that is basically what I'm trying to say. And now let's check out picture number three. This is him, of course, coming out from underneath the ring. I just, I, I can't praise this enough. I cannot praise his new look enough. It is so damn terrifying. Here we go with the next one, guys. This is him, uh, you know, just hovering over Alexa Bliss there after she pinned Randy Orton. Uh, it looked kind of wrong, I'm not going to lie. I was actually kind of jealous, uh, you know, that Randy got to be in that situation. But uh, anyways, guys, just look at the fiend there. You can definitely tell they changed his attire up completely here. No more black tank top with the praying hands and no more red and black tights. They completely changed his look up here, and I am loving it. I also like how they made his hands look burnt, and they also have the glove, like, melting off. It's so crazy, guys, and this is the final picture that I have for you. Uh, you know, it's not a very good one. It's a little blurry, but, uh, it's, it's just incredible. I love his new look. I, I absolutely think, you know, WWE should put him into some type of horror movie, like I said, because it just looks so damn scary, and I, I love it. He looks like legitimate now. He looks like he could just absolutely destroy anybody that steps in the ring with him. Like, The Fiend was obviously a threat before. Now, he just looks like he is gonna be damn unstoppable. He kinda has like a, kinda like a Jason Voorhees type of vibe going on mixed with Freddy Krueger, cause obviously Freddy Krueger got burnt and stuff like that. But he has like that just that Jason Voorhees type of look. Obviously, he doesn't have a hockey mask or anything like that like Jason does, but he just kind of reminds me of Jason. I don't know why, mixed with Freddy Krueger. Like, if they had a love child, this would be it right here, and he just looks phenomenal in my opinion. But anyways, guys, that's gonna do it here for the video. Let me know what you think about The Fiend's brand new attire. Do you guys like it? Do you guys hate it? Do you think WWE could have done a little bit better with this? Let me know your thoughts and comments and opinions by commenting down below in the comment section. But anyways, guys, once again, if you did go on to enjoy the video, make sure you do smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new, turn that notification bell on, and I'll catch you guys all in the next video. Take care, and of course, peace out.